Now there's a bunch of different ways you can serve a whole fried fish, but why not serve it like this? Deboned, easy to eat with a delicious pineapple chili sauce. We made our pineapple chili sauce. If you haven't made it yet, check the recipe up here and you can make our homemade pineapple chili sauce with fresh pineapple. It's really quite delicious. We're gonna saute some vegetables in there. You can add some bell peppers, whatever you like really. And we're just using rice flour so it is gluten free. If you like to, you can use all purpose flour if you want that brown color, but the crispiness is still there with the rice flour. It's just gluten free and it comes out a little white, which I think is kind of cool. So try this out. Let me know. Try this out. Let me know what you guys think of our pineapple whole fried branzino. Here we have some branzino that we got just from Costco. They are scaled. Uh, we're just going to remove the spine so that it is boneless. <laughs> Check out the video on the top and how to do that. Here we have our meats and plus. We have our garlic, pineapple, onions, and then what other vegetables you want. We have a bowl of cornstarch, and then we have a bowl that we're going to add rice flour to, and then add water to make a thin batter. Once you have the batter ready, preheat your oil. While the oil is preheating, grab a saute pan and add oil. Add your vegetables of choice. Give them a nice little saute. Once they're nicely sauteed, add your pineapple sweet chili sauce and the recipe is up here in the top corner or in the link below that's done hold it warm take your boneless bronzino that's an option and then dip it into the cornstarch dredge once it's in the cornstarch dip it into your rice batter and then drop it into your pot of hot oil about 350 degrees give it a little fry and then i'm going to shape it into a u shape by putting it against the side of the pot and then i'm going to flip it every three minutes until nice and crispy and fully cooked if you have a big enough pot to cook this in then you can do it like that without making the shape but i think this shape is kind of cool once they're once the fish is fried we're just going to top our garnishes on top or you can serve it on the side however you choose and there we have it we have our pineapple sweet chili whole fried bronzino with some cilantro and some scallion herbs bon appetit super delicious and nice and flaky meat from that fish and the nice sweet chili sour salty tangy sauce how i do it is just kind of pick around the head and the tail if you like it's good for nibbling and just get a big old spoon or fork full of all that beautiful fish and a little bit of the pineapple sauce take a bite and enjoy